Cholesterol Unveiled, Separating Myths from the Truth. Welcome to a deep dive into the world of cholesterol. For decades, cholesterol has suffered a bad reputation. It's been wrongly characterized as a harmful substance, unfairly maligned as a major player in heart disease, and wrongly associated with arterial blockages. But, as we'll soon discover, the story of cholesterol is much more nuanced. We will not only debunk the myths, but also reveal the conspiracy that has surrounded this essential substance for far too long. The story of cholesterol's vilification is as complex as it is intriguing. It involves some major players, including pharmaceutical giants and the food industry. Why? Because the fear surrounding cholesterol translates into enormous profits. Let's start with Big Pharma. The pharmaceutical industry has reaped colossal financial rewards by selling cholesterol-lowering drugs known as statins. Statins are among the most prescribed drugs globally. The perception that cholesterol is the ultimate villain is central to this financial success. But is it all it seems? Consider this. Cholesterol, like any other substance in the body, has a delicate balance. Too much or too little can have adverse effects on your health. Statins work by reducing cholesterol levels, but are they doing more harm than good? We'll explore this later. Processed and low-fat food products are ubiquitous in the market. These products often sport labels shouting low cholesterol. The food industry has capitalized on the fear of cholesterol producing a wide array of low cholesterol foods, many of which are far from healthy. Let's shift our focus to the science. What does cholesterol actually do in the body? You might be surprised to learn that cholesterol is an indispensable molecule. Cholesterol is a structural component of cell membranes. It ensures that these membranes remain fluid and functional. In simpler terms, cholesterol helps maintain the integrity of your cells, a crucial role that impacts everything from basic bodily functions to complex metabolic processes. Here's something fascinating. Cholesterol is vital for your brain. It plays a pivotal role in synapse function, enabling those essential connections between brain cells. Without adequate cholesterol, cognitive processes and memory function could suffer. Who would have thought that the brain, one of the most critical organs in the body, relies on cholesterol? Cholesterol is not just a passive participant. It's an active contributor to your hormonal health. It serves as a precursor to various molecules, including the stress hormone cortisol and sex hormones, like estrogen and testosterone. So, next time you consider your hormonal balance, remember that cholesterol plays an essential role. With the functions of cholesterol in mind, it's time to peel back the layers of the cholesterol conspiracy. Recent revelations have cast new light on this enigmatic nutrient. The dark side of low cholesterol. As we've seen, Cholesterol is essential for numerous bodily functions. Paradoxically, lowering cholesterol levels too much can lead to detrimental health outcomes. For instance, extremely low cholesterol has been associated with cognitive decline. If cholesterol is vital for brain function, then this correlation makes sense. the controversy surrounding statins. Despite statins being widely prescribed as cholesterol-lowering agents, the effectiveness of these drugs is subject to considerable debate. Some studies suggest they might not be the miracle drugs they've been touted to be. Their side effects can be concerning, with muscle pain and weakness being a common issue for many users. How many people have to take it before one person's helped? 300. 300 people have to take the drug for a year before one heart attack, stroke, or other adverse event is prevented. So, for this particular drug, the side effects occur in 5% of the patients. 
and they include terrible things, debilitating muscle and joint pain. But now you're thinking, well, 5%, not very likely it's going to happen to me, I'll still take the drug. But wait a minute. 300 people take the drug, right? 5% of those 300 have side effects. That's 15 people. You're 15 times more likely to be harmed by the drug <laughs> than you are to be helped by the drug. Now that we've unveiled the myths and separated fact from fiction, it's essential to approach cholesterol with a fresh perspective. Instead of obsessing over low cholesterol, we should focus on optimal cholesterol. Diet and lifestyle choices. Rather than relying on medication, the key to maintaining healthy cholesterol levels is through lifestyle choices. A balanced diet, rich in whole foods like fruits, vegetables, quality meat from animals that had been pasture-raised and grass-fed, foods like highly processed vegetable and seed oils, margarine, white bread and sugar must be avoided like the plague if your goal to promote heart health and health in general. Regular exercise can also help you maintain optimal cholesterol levels. As we conclude our journey through the myths and truths about cholesterol, the takeaway is clear. Cholesterol isn't the enemy it's been portrayed as. It's an essential nutrient with crucial functions in our bodies. Understanding the complexities of cholesterol empowers us to make informed choices about our health. In the pursuit of good health, it's essential to critically examine the information we've been presented. Cholesterol is no exception to this rule. The cholesterol conspiracy, woven by various interests, has done the nutrient a disservice for far too long. But with a fresh perspective and a commitment to informed choices, we can reclaim our understanding of cholesterol and its significance in our lives. So, the next time you see those low cholesterol labels on food products or consider starting statin medication, remember the full story. Cholesterol is not the foe we've been led to believe. It's a versatile and crucial substance in our bodies, deserving of respect rather than fear. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening exploration of cholesterol. Remember, knowledge is power when it comes to your health. Stay informed, stay healthy, and approach cholesterol with a balanced perspective. And remember, your health is your most valuable asset.